Hello, everybody, and welcome to another race in the Fire Leaf Green Tournament 2023. So, today we have uh, Cooker playing against Wave, playing against Chippy Toothy, um, and probably one of the more exciting races of this round. Um, I'm here today with Amoeba, and we'll be, we'll be commentating together. You know what? I'm excited for this one. I feel like this is the potentially the closest race of this round. Yeah, it should, should definitely be really good. Um, yeah. <laughs> I think definitely um, Chippy being a pot one, not his best draw. Um, but I mean, <laughs> they're, all, they're all pretty. They're all pretty capable runners, and honestly, anyone anyone can run and it's, win this one. I think it's quite interesting. There's been a there's been a lot of noise about Chippy uh, just generally from races recently, and he's been doing very very well in races. Um, but yeah, to to get pot one out of round one and then pull world record contender wave warrior and world record holder Kuka is like, <laughs> damn, really? <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, just waiting on the racers to give the OKs. We're going to start pretty soon. I do want to uh, shout out and appreciate the fact that they've all gone for a slightly different color scheme. Somehow they're all looking at the same color, but we've got blue, purple, and lilac. Oh wow! Yeah, very interesting. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, we've got uh, Kuka's going to be on emulator. I actually don't know what. Oh, Chippy must be on GBI because he's got the input display. So Kuka's going to have to wait twenty five seconds at the start if he remembers. If not, we're going to have to remember to take it off. He has just said in race time, "I give them a twenty five second head start to be nice." Right. All right. It's not Chippy ready to be nice. ready. All right. Uh, okay. They've been released. The countdown's starting. Should be off momentarily then. So yeah, this is this is going to be a good one. Um, Kook is not showing what stats he's got on this turtle yet because he's going to be going for a minute if he uh, sees it. He said. Yeah. Which would be high. We haven't actually had anybody hit one in like two tournaments at this point. <laughs> yeah, I think people have just like given up on trying to go for it because you could just get a better, better one by just grinding out high frames. But um... I'm sorry, okay, the Cougar... timer was slightly late. That okay? Cougar taking his penalty right now. Uh, less work on our end at the end. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the timer is going to be slightly off. I uh, missed it by 10 seconds. I apologize. But we'll just uh, correct that towards the end and we'll go off the race time times anyway. So right, right. We'll know what people get. Yeah, Waves Turtle is kind of stacked. I mean, Chippies is basically the same thing except just 30 special attack. It's like really the only yeah. difference. Just the, I'm curious if either of them gets screwed by the 31 speed. Um, yeah. With the car boss being an issue for Bruno. Yeah, um, yeah, we was asking about that earlier. Um, definitely could be pretty bad if you don't realize that and just go into Bruno with too many speed EVs. Yeah, they'll both be aware of it, but you can just be forced into it because the only real way to get five speed EVs is two Route 1 encounters and Josh, and you just might not have the HP for Josh. Right, right, right. Although it only matters for um one of the strats, I forget which one. So it's not actually that big of a deal? It's, yeah, well it basically forces you to do guard spec-less. Uh, no, it forces you to do guard spec, because um, it, one rock tomb doesn't guarantee the outspeed. Okay, yeah, so that's not great. So for a second, <laughs> yeah. And that can just be terrible if you've got the wrong HP. If you go in at 80, then it's just like, yeah, cool, I'll do that strat. Uh. Did Kuka get the Squirtle? Be pretty hype. Not showing any stats on there, so I don't even know what one he's potentially aiming. No, okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he didn't see one though. Maybe uh, he just like pull up his stats. His... Right, so Kuka's backup turtle is a mild 22 17, 21 31, 10 30. So amazing offenses. Well, the attack's okay. Um, defenses are fairly middling. 
Yeah, Miles, a lot of people have been straying away from in races. Just can be a little bit scarier for, for Brock's gym and Koga's gym and a bunch of other places. Yeah. He does have them ready, that was uh, good by him. The wave with a somewhat decent early lead. I did not see uh, what happened to Chippy. Me neither. Also can't see much of what's happening to the wave. <laughs> I'm just going <laughs> to give his a little refresh once he's past this rat, just to see if we can get a few more frames activated. Next frame, please. Although it's, it's calmed down a little bit now, maybe I won't. Yeah, Wave's got his early experience. Chippy's got his. I'm a big fan of the early potion. It's good safety. Yeah. I mean, honestly, like, if you have enough potions, it's like, not really much to worry about with the Brock fight itself. Whereas yeah. in PB attempts, it can be really, really scary without a potion. Yeah, with uh, with everybody using backup Squirtles, it means you can't you can't take the PC potion as a save. So realistically, your only options are that potion and the Viridian Forest one. You really don't want to delay it in case you get ruined by uh, the right one encounters. Mm -hmm. Chippy going for level 7 off of this level 3 bird, he doesn't 3-shot it and he misses. This is a lot of damage. Not even Torrent for Bubble. So, I mean, it's not the end of the world, but... Um, Would have been nice, I guess. Kuka's caught up to Chippy already, but Chippy is level 7, so... Kind of expected. There really isn't much to do. We've somehow managed to sync all three of them up into a very boring point where they're all just walking about and doing nothing. Yeah. It's got <laughs> someone get to the grass so we can talk about some stuff. Ooh, Kuku but... took an extra step. There you go, that's something. Moving on. So, Wave's going to get the potion. He's also going to be looking for... I think they're all on Leaf Green. I don't think anybody's doing Fire Red. Uh, yeah. So, Sandshrew's an option for all of them. So he's googling how do I remove mouse in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we've got a rat. Does he go for the... He might go for the experience here. Because he wants the... Oh no, he's going to catch it. That's interesting. He really wants five speed IVs. I wonder if taking the three shot on that rat would have been a better choice. Never know because he's literally a slideshow for some reason. <laughs> Unfortunately, can't do much about it anymore. I've tried refreshing it and it's just not having it. Will he kill an encounter to get. <laughs> there we we'll go. Yeah, there okay. he is. Oh, oh of course my he goodness. gets a defense rat. <laughs> Wow. So unlike, and he gets a crit. Okay. Works out. Uh, Chippy's gonna throw the ball? That's a little scary, you are dead to a crit here. And that's that's not even 78, is it? Um, and it's in. <laughs> Doesn't well. matter anymore. <laughs> so that's, that's a rat for Wave, a rat for Chippy, and a bird for Kuka. That's a 1% for Kuka. Another bird. Will he get bubble? He will not. Um, he really doesn't need the uh, like yeah. miles kind of five shot. He uh, doesn't need. He's got thirty speed, which uh, IMO is perfect. A big thirty speed enjoyer. Oh, and he gets his rat. Oh 
Oh, that's... Okay. Gotta heal that, surely. Yeah. Yeah, that's not great. Only one potion for up to Brock now. Well, you can go for the... There is, a like, a second potion below Sammy, but it's a bit of a detour. Oh, that's true, yeah. But he's also at nearly max health, to be honest. He might just take the save before and roll with it. Chat saying that Amoeba has the voice for a podcast. I, I happen to agree. I wonder if he's he's engaged in that kind of activity before. <laughs> when you say engaged in that kind of activity, that makes it sound way seedier. Has <laughs> 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 he delved in such things? But thank you, guys. So at the moment, we've got Chippy and Wave on one friend each. Cuckoo's got both. And I'd say Wave's probably still got the lead, but it kind of will depend on forest encounters. I haven't counted so far, but it seems like he's doing okay. Does he get the frame perfect potion pickup? Nope. Yeah, it seems like he's got the lead, if I had to guess. But Sam Sammy's, uh, you know, not the best fight, <laughs> so we'll see what happens. The Great Equalizer. He does Chippy and Wave do a bubble, so it should be quite a bit better. Chippy opting for the other potion down below that we mentioned earlier. A wise choice. Yeah, I think I agree. I was kind of curious if Wave would go for that, because he does have Torrent, but if you miss the range and get hit, it's over. Yeah. He's got his poison, so he can kind of go whatever HP he wants. The zigzags are not faster, but they do look kind of neat. Crit Poison on the first turn for Chippy. But... Seems like we'll probably be okay. I just seeing if we can get a bit of an improvement on the frame drops on Wave's side. Thankfully he's not doing anything important. Chippy in basically the same situation Wave was in and also opting to heal. Again, wise choice. Yeah, the, this fight is like pretty devastating. I mean, I know you save for it, but like, it can be pretty, pretty bad to die. I just, my favorite part of it is that it hits Poison Sting for three, but crits for eight. <laughs> yeah, like that's just lovely. Gen seven level damage ranges out here. Crits are just awful in this fight. Yeah. All three of them leave him with poison, which is nice. I think they all had a fairly fairly chilled out Sammy fight. If you with the crit, but it was early. I think everybody counts correctly. <laughs> We've got Sanded, I don't know if he's missed or not. Paul's jump. He, he did, did miss. He got scratch. Uh, bubbling for his life. Okay. Well, 
PB attempt, you'd just be... You'd just be... You'd, you'd be dead right now, but... I wonder if at level 11 it's correct to maybe heal on Geo, dude. I'm not actually sure. Because at level 11 it is a 14 and 16 range to kill, even out of Torrent. Much improved from the level 10s and 0 and 16. That range never made sense to me, but whatever. <laughs> Healing into tackle. Wait, wait. Why did I get tackle? Oh, it must have been a range now. And he actually got rolled for four too. So was that pseudo roll four into four? So what? He entered at five, didn't he? Yeah. No, it'd have been pseudo roll five into four. So he got pseudo oh, max yeah. rolled. That's yeah, gross. Yeah. <laughs> Very interesting full yellow HP bar. Simply tackling a bit <laughs> after missing the range. That's decent help. He's probably gonna. Well, he's definitely gonna have to stall a turn on the first blood capture. But Chippy's leaving with okay health. Waves also okay, but will also need to stall a turn. And Gook is a slightly high. Uh, yeah. He's gonna have to stall the first turn, which is kind of worse. I feel like you just always end up with this kind of HP. Yeah. <laughs> Coming out of Brock. Kind of, kind of icky. It's amazing how, in principle, you should always leave in like good HP, and this fight should generally be fine. It just never is. It's it's <laughs> always terrible. <laughs> Everyone out of Brock around the 15 minute mark, so nobody behind too far yet. Cooker does have two pokes, so he is closer than it might appear. Yeah, this is uh, it's pretty similar times overall, to be honest. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Maybe Cooker has the lead, given that he had the 25 second deficit, so he's going to gradually save little bits of time throughout the run. But yeah, it's definitely a close one. Cougar doing the early shopping, early surge shopping here, unlike the other two. So we're gonna see see both in this race. Once again, a determining factor in who wins is typically the worst fight in the game for PB attempts. Chippy's got tackle for two, which I guess is normal, but I mean, he's, he's got torrent for 14 if he doesn't plus three, but I don't know yeah. my HP value is well enough. 24, isn't 24 the weird one? I think oh so, yeah. But I don't know where it's, it's weird for Brock, but that might be because of the plus threes beforehand, so he might just be fine. And... I don't know what happened to Wave, but he does not have Torrent, which is kind of dookie. <laughs> he needs a hit here from Weedle. Or just, he might just hit the range. He got again. the range, yeah. yeah. Go for it at this point, then. 
losing a couple turns coming up. Looks like all of them are probably gonna be too shy in the final Metapod. Their HP is right now. I mean, Wave's potentially gonna have very safe HP for doing draw. Just a kiss an upside for his. Which yeah, that's looks true. Really good for that as well. Yeah, you really wanna. There's a big incentive to do draw for 31 speed. To get those 5 speed EVs. Um, so we'll see. If they like, yeah, try to do it. Cooker and Chippy literally synced right now. You love to see it. Why is Wave thinking so long? <laughs> he not know the route. <laughs> Rechalking the slight uh, lead to Cooker to emulator for frame rate. <laughs> uh, well, he's already taken his deficit, so technically no. He's got the outright lead if he's close. Does that right. make sense? Oh, interesting. Wave has found his bird. And now Cooker and Chippy are synced, or uh, Wave and Chippy are synced. Oh, Crippy Chippy. Uh, well, it's speedy, V. Oh, well, yeah. What if he does it again? He can go for Rocket. That's <laughs> <laughs> oh, And a Mankey. Oh, this Route 3 sucks. I hate this draft. Yeah, we got Neater and Fever. <laughs> <For> God's sake. <laughs> I think like, yeah. people talk about not grinding in Route 1, but I see this happen to so many people so often in both like this grass and the one after Mount Moon. Like, it's just gross. At least, like, unless you've already got one, you're guaranteed a good encounter on Route 1. Yeah. I mean, I'd, uh, yeah, if you have no encounters in Route 1, Route 1, I really, really do not hate grinding. Oh! Ooh. Um. Oh, he was fighting Rocky, okay. Okay, I think that was okay, just, yeah. uh, just miss movement. <laughs> yeah. Uh, wave? Why is he doing that? Oh, he gets tail whip. Uh, Wave's not fought Josh. Isn't that gonna He's scream? fighting a hiker. He did say he was doing late surge. I don't know how that works out. <laughs> yeah. But, not hmm. sure. At Ananan in the chat. Well, what, what? You get extra speedy bees in late surge. Doesn't seem right. No, I think. It, well, I don't know. I don't know if your level will just be different at that point. Oh, okay. Yeah, definitely possible. So yeah, sorry about the uh, the audio for this moment, guys. We're trying to get a backup stream of waves working so that you can hopefully view that. Should be getting the revive, just basically required for races. Um, just give way too much safety to forego, especially in the early game fights like Rival 2, just one of the worst fights. Oh, Chippy did opt to go for Rocket. Oh, what is happening? And he got the range. Hmm, okay. I think they're both about to have, well, they're both potentially going to have terrible Bruno fights, but uh, maybe we're just too hung up on the Bruno strat. We'll see, we'll see what happens. It's also possible they just don't even get the Carbos. And just x speed. Also true.
wave very far from Torrent. And, and we're there. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, everybody thank Jordan who has fixed Wave's feed in the background. Hopefully. It's looking good now, though. Stupid just checking he's got the right ID. <laughs> Yeah, I think everybody's got everything friend-wise now as well, so we are pretty much yep. like lined up in terms of uh, routes at least. So Kuka with a really commanding lead, got the full yeah. nerd fight ahead of him. Yeah, it's like a good at least 40 seconds ahead of Wave, and then yeah. more over Tiffy. So yeah, um, and he's only going to save more to the emulator. We have crits the Voltorb. Very nice. I'm almost certain Kuka will be doing early surge because I don't imagine he has ever bothered to learn late surge. <laughs> Wally where he says, imagine Kuka reading the notes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that, but more polite. Chippy's been disabled water gun. Does get oh, the range on Grimer though. That's something. Undisabled turn two. Never looking. Oh, and crits Ooh. the Voltorb. Okay. And it kills, wow. <laughs> Holy moly. Now undisabled and it's all fine? <laughs> okay! <Wow. laughs> that range on Voltorb's gotta be bad. <laughs> <laughs> Did he get disable water gun into a four turn fight? That's kind of yeah. gross. <laughs> yeah, we'll get audio swapped over to Kuka in a little bit. We're just, uh, well, I say we, I mean Jordan is doing some behind the scenes work. Don't you worry. So switch the audio to Randall. I am happy to announce. <laughs> you could go into Misty. I presume that everybody picked up the person Berry. Well, maybe Kuka did not with Mild. It's possible Kuka didn't, yeah. Um... Would we see it in that menu? No. If it's holding a held item? Unfortunately not. But yeah, we're never really gonna know for a while. Oh my goodness. He's, he's not gonna get water pulse too. Really bad roll for Kuka. This might still live, right? No, that should be fine. Generally. <laughs> I wouldn't want to bet money on it being 100%. But... That health is not great for Guga. You don't really want a potion to 31. Yeah, 31's pretty bad. But... But, I mean, you got a really good start. A very low 26 Misty is definitely good yeah, for a race. Great for races. I mean, they're all going to be pretty good times. Wave's going to get a 26, likely, too. Is he going to go for it? I wouldn't. Yeah, I wouldn't either. <laughs> like, the exact same health? No, No, that's great health. He's going to get 20, yeah. 21, 22. And yeah, like on, this, yeah, on this rash, he's only taking 16 to 20 or something like that. With from Vine Whip, so yeah, just wants to dodge damage, ideally. We're all gonna dodge confusion, that'd be, that'd be cool. I hope so, I don't want Chippy to get it, I want a closer race than that. Although, I mean, if we have Frozen, like, oh, that's the same role as Cooker. Wow. 
absolutely no confusion. 19 again. Misses. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Cooper asleep on the source, so he's going to be kicking for his life. Is it? Okay. Yeah. Wonderful. Be good fight for him. Just to keep his arrive for another day. Wave really wants to flinch here. Ooh, that unfortunate. A tackle for five. <laughs> Works out fairly nicely for the way. Should be getting Vine Whip here most of the time. Oh, yeah. Well, not if we don't give it a turn. Also true. Flinch is great. There you go. <laughs> oh, that's a very good fight. A bit slow on the Pidgeotto, but you're always going to take that. Yeah. All Pidgeotto healing situations better than Link Seed. Should we not save? Ooh. Not sure I agree with that. Also went for Water Pulse turn 1 when not in Torrent. Definitely a misplay because you want the Bite Flinch ideally. Well, I don't think he's going to get punished for it. It's basically got the same setup as Wave. Mm -hmm. Flinch, please. Come on. Wow. wow. Some great races here. Wow. Yeah. Three good rival twos. Holy moly. Oh, that's a misplay. Yeah. You gotta pulse that. Unless you had time. It's still a range even with pulse, actually. Yes, it's 14 and 16, something like that. We got Torrent. We got very high HP, but not exactly complaining. Yeah, There's not much to talk about now for the rest of the bridge, apart from Dan Pass. And, and then Dan Pass. Yeah. Kuka's at the worst potential health here, and of course he misses. Oh, this is scary now. Does he just take the heal? I probably would. Don't He's kicking. Wow. He okay. Oh my goodness. The scary thing about that is, is his health is still kind of monker for quick attacks. Oh, like, yeah. And potioning there would have just been totally fine. I don't know that I agree with that risk, but he's alive, he's kicking. Is that honest guaranteed to absorb? No, it's 50-50 to absorb or sweet scent, I think. Makes sense. It has a completely useless move. We have kicked. And crit, that Oddish is extra dead. <laughs> Should've just gotten Mega Punch and used that and crit. More accurate. <laughs> Imagine if the concept of Red Bar was added to this game. It'd be such a little, way more chaotic. It'd be kind of cool, because if you had Torn and Red Bar, you were just so, like, incentivized to play as risky as possible. I know. That would be kind of fun. Then, then, might as well add instant text while we're having fun. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. We have the, the perfect race game. Everyone's favorite. We saw Chippy bit the Oddish. Um, I don't know if he's going to do that for all the Oddishes. I know Wanley does that. And... I'm a fan of know. fighting the bridge one, to be fair. Because your, your Mega Kick count just becomes way nicer. That's true, yeah, that's a good point. No no risk of running out, really.
I was confused for a second because I thought Wave was talking to the rocket after the fight, and I was like, how did that happen? <laughs> how did Wave take a lead on Ku? But I just forgot what the dude says because I don't read it anymore. Thanks, Jordan. Surprise, he's actually a rocket. What kind of damn passes are we going to see? I think we're just going to see three YOLOs. People used to do the Shiro pass a lot more. I feel like it's just kind of gone out of style. People did it a lot in the second tournament because Anna would give you five subs if you hit it perfectly. Oh, yeah. Which is the only reason I signed up. <laughs> Hey, there's like a, a a threshold of skill. It's not very high, <laughs> <laughs> but it's there. Kuka with the perfect the perfect YOLO, if that makes sense. It almost feels silly to say. But... It did make me twenty so You are correct, then. Interesting that you had that figure to hand quicker than I did, but yeah. Wave as well. Perfect pass. Probably worth mentioning, although I imagine it's been covered in other races already, but uh, second round of these races, everybody that wins advances. Everybody that finishes second advances, and the best, the single best third place time will also advance. We're only losing six races from this round. Yeah, so it really incentivizes people to play for for placement over yeah. uh, over time, unlike the first round. So, so we, we're going down from twenty one to fifteen. So there's only five pot one places available, which will be determined by time. So even like finishing, like winning your race is not a guarantee that you're going to be part one, which it never is. But the times are a lot more influential this uh, round. Chippy going for double bag. I appreciate it. He was facing left, so he had to. Are you, I feel like people normally go for the single bag and then just yell at the second pass. But yeah. Oh, I don't like that. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. He double backed it. The Juan Lee world record strapped it. Who we went for the water pulse range and got it. It's a hard range to hit. Something like 5 and 16, isn't it? Yeah, it's not great, the second one. Mm. First first one only possible with knob strats, so that one's much better, but. That's also a thing we don't see anymore. Nobody really doing knob strats now. Yeah. Wave misses. He's got the health to manage that, although he doesn't have the kits, unfortunately. What are knob strats? You fight Hiker Knob instead of the uh, the trainer above him, who and the Hiker has three Geo dudes and a match up, I think. Well, that might be yeah, it's one. yeah, literally, yeah, exactly what they're saying in chat right now. It's just very similar to Late Surge in, t in terms of like ranges you get. Yeah. It's early surge with late surge mid game. There's way too many words in that sentence for my brain. <laughs> I just can't pass what he's saying. It's got early late mid. <laughs> Still with a fairly commanding lead. I think waves eat a little bit of time up on him, but not much. Cooper hits his last kick. Very nice. Missing that drowsy with one kick left is pretty slow. 
I love hypnosis. <laughs> How's the gap? Um, yeah, they're both like in their couple minute or so in between each person. Maybe a bit more. I think I actually underestimated how long this fight takes. I think the, the gap between them is actually more than it was before. Have the late surgers already fought their extra experience? I don't know what people do. Is it normally Franklin uh, or...? No, it, what does late surge do? It literally just... You heal before boat rival. What, is there any extra experience at all? I don't think there is. I think they just heal before boat rival. Oh boy. Oh, Wave's in trouble. Ooh. We have got uh, confused by confusion. Oh, oh, you just went goodness. for the kick. Oh okay. my god. <laughs> Good lord. I mean, reward that, is what? That was Damn. scary. Now, clicking that kick, kick took some guts. That was not a good situation. Yeah, I thought for late surge you had to fight like either like the top hiker with like three, three dudes. I don't believe or... so. I think they literally, they will, they do a kind of grosser boat rival fight, and uh... then they have worse ranges in rock tunnel, and then they just have to come back and fight Surge later. Chippy also missing on the drowsing has to bite it. I'm just gonna keep saying stuff about late Surge until somebody in chat that actually knows what they're talking about correctly. Yeah, so in Late Surge you actually don't get any candies, and you hit more kicks, and... It's, it's called Late way. Surge because they do it after the run's finished. <laughs> uh, Wave actually got a 1% Pidgey in the grass as well. It's gross. And Kuka kind of steaming ahead at the moment, although it all could come crashing down because he is going to be doing Early Surge. Or he could save a minute by getting away with it straight away. This health's kind of weird. He's gonna not potion. Ooh, fifteen. Oh, he's got miles. I don't know what the range. He's not saving. I hate the way Kuka plays. He scares me so much. <laughs> so all these choices, I'm like, I would have done that. I would have done that. Sake is wrong. I'm just the way Kuka plays is very different to the way I'd want to play it. No way this tanks mine up, right? I don't think there's any universe. I want to say it's like 16 to 20 on good rashes, so no, I don't think this tanks it in any way. So you make oh, it's just going to super turn one. Yeah, so because it's a guaranteed final? Yeah. Okay, I guess that makes sense. Oh, Mega Kick turn one. Oh. Actually, that was a. I wonder if he missed. This is like kind of. Yeah, he's going to get. Now. He's going to get leech seeded. I think he kicked turn one there, presuming leech seed, because then two kicks still kill. This is kind of gross now. Okay, yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, Wave's going in at full health because of Late Surge. Get Sand Attacked, Groves. He's switching too. Should be getting the Bike Blaster now. I don't think I've seen that before. Yeah, I think they can do it before or after. I don't think it loses any time on Late Surge. And I'm just going to commit to that statement 100% and Ananan can type in the chat if I'm wrong. I mean, but it makes sense. So, yeah. yeah, I believe it. Wave also may be kicking turn one. I think it's so that I think you're it more is likely to... to get Vine Whip. Since it might. Uh, yeah. I actually thought it was just because Bite plus Kick won't kill if you get Leech Seed. But yeah, maybe. If he's in Overgrowth, he might just be more likely to want to Vine Whip you. Typically, that works a bit better when he was on when you're on like more Cougar's HP, because then you get hit into Torrent, so you can Water Pulse the Raticate. Think that was a strat. That. We're only confirming it is to force Vine Whip more often. Yeah, kind of a gross fight for Cougar and a pretty good one for the Wave, even with the Sand Attack. Ooh, Chippy's got Chesso Berry. Hey, he did say he was going to do this. All right. What's this cool? Chippy's in the kitchen. <laughs> what is this man cooking? <laughs> let him cook, man. Who let him cook? Quick 
Rocket Attack from Full HP. How fortunate. And again. And another. So yeah, Chippy's doing the same thing. Oh, and he misses. Ugh. Just so very works. And the man's a genius. Now he gets Vine Whip. Genius. <laughs> wow, incredible. And he misses the range, no! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, well he's not dead, I guess, so it's just kind of fine. He's just going to have to heal on the rack. Uh, we're going to see if Kuka is fortunate with cans and Surge. And Wave's going to disappear off after getting his bite voucher. So we're really not going to know much about Cuckoo compared to the other two for a while now. Hands leaving a lot to be desired so far. Alright. Well, that one's okay. That's a good one. I think it's down. It's right. Well, as long as it's not left. <laughs> We're both wrong. <laughs> oh, I think, yeah, that's... No, it was left long. <laughs> I think that's part of the, the late search thing as well, is that Wave's just picked up the candy that Pupa has already used before Boat Rival. I think that accounts for some of the XP difference. Hmm. Yeah, we can... Alright, time for Surge. Truly saves. Oh my god. Wow, okay. This, he saved before Tucker. <laughs> so I, he's gonna have to reset and do the fight again yeah. if he dies. I honestly think the correct play there was after you got that first cam was to fight the gentleman and then save afterwards. And just do your second cam after that. It's a little bit of extra walking, but you're gonna look like a damn fool if you have to reset it. He outsped the Voltorb, so he has taken zero damage. T wave. Ooh, shockwave shock turn one. Get confusion? For 38. <laughs> oh, that's oh so God. good. That's I can't so believe it. good. I can't believe it. Simply hit the kick. Unreal. <laughs> <laughs> that is disgustingly good. <laughs> <laughs> that was a fight. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, if you're doing early surge and you don't see a double team, that's a W. <laughs> Congrats, you won the fight. Yeah, his, uh, his special defense I don't think is quite good enough to often live two shockwaves, but it was close. He certainly could have done. Yeah, what's the range on that? I thought body ball was a high roll. That might just be rashes. I don't do enough miles. Um, nice pass there from Wave. Yes, 37 to 44. Eight. So very unlikely to live. He literally needed a mineral wall next burst. <laughs> Is there a world where Cuckoo just like catches up to them with Surge already fought? Things would have to go wrong, I think, like fairly significantly. But maybe. It's not like, far away at all. Cuckoo just like zoomed through Surge's gym. <laughs> Wave doesn't have Torrent either, and I know that Torrent's like a lot more key. Before yes, Wave Surge. yes, definitely. <laughs> the one thing I remember about Lace Surge is you gotta water pulse the Vulpix because Water Gun doesn't kill. Oh, that's silly. <laughs> <laughs> the 
copy bastard currently ripping through chat is very funny. <laughs> yeah, Chippy's uh, in a slightly better state at the moment than Wave as well, and Wave lost a bit of time on the, the four Pokemon girl with the Oddishes. Because of a uh, missed kick, I think. So it's getting closer between uh, Chippy and Wave, but Kuka definitely has a lead. Yeah. And a sizable one of that. Despite that, Wave's gonna be the first to, to reach Martha, so we'll see how that goes for him. Quite a miserable fight. Come on, Chippy. You got in there eventually. Bonking both sides of the door like it's that been was high. That was something. So Wave was the only one to get the red to bike this run. Well, I guess I guess Cooker got it, but he had to run back and forth a couple times. <laughs> I looked away for two seconds and I see Oddish is confused. Why was he pulsing an Otto? <laughs> is that a thing? Is that what they do? His late surges are a different breed, man. I can't understand it. Oh, well, I guess he only had one kick. So I guess it's better than biting. Maybe he has a chance to die or something. 88%? Wow. That is a very high range. Kuka's health is kind of high. I don't know how much that's going to be a deal. I'm sure I'll be fine. <laughs> it's Kuka, yeah. He'll be fine. Seems like a good Martha for Chippy. Well, he's got to hit a kick first, actually. I really should not have said that. <laughs> I too blame Headbob for this impending Chippy death. Okay. I live to see another day. I think Ooh, very close that. to the kill. Oh, okay. I was, very uh... Close. I was baited by the low words. I thought he'd hit the range. <laughs> I think that's only one. 2 in 16 at 31, isn't it? Or is it 1? Uh, is it the first one? Is it the second one? I think it's only 1. It's the second one, yeah. Yeah, see, it wasn't crazy, so he's fighting him a chop right now. Wave. Yeah, oh. this, is top, this is top hiker. Yeah, so this oh, is a little I bit of extra experience. Um, yeah, it's just like one per one poke's worth of extra experience, which is really all you need. So you can, I, I think you can either do that or you can fight um, Franklin on Route 25 instead of the Onyx guy. Oh, that makes I think sense. I, I don't know what conditions you'd ever do Franklin. I don't. Maybe people just don't even do that anymore. People are edging. Um. Oh. 
Yeah, Cougar is literally one fight behind Chippy right now. It's just insane. And it's also it's a shorter fight as well, because it's on early set. Cougar's definitely going for the bite, check it. Damn. Um, I would have expected him to bite that as well. If you tank the, the damage, I feel like it's a good play. It does suck when you miss it. Yeah. Perfect for wave. Good work. What just happened? I think we've we've maybe missed a kick and had to heal on the Oddish in fight. Um, so not great. I'm kind of curious. All oh, right, so he, yeah, I thought you didn't kick afterwards. But yeah, I think his kick count is still fine for hit lavender strat. I think I saw he has three right now. If I... Yes. Plenty. Wasn't mistaken. Wow, yeah, you really are, like, quite a bit lower experience on Late Surge. You're like, you hit 31 like two fights later. Missing the dismount, so he takes the audio lag. Otherwise, clean. Getting past us the big bit. Yeah, they are. <laughs> it's kind of weird how they're basically the same distance apart as they were, but Cougar's already been in search. <laughs> yeah. It's just like Actually, the leaves on the swap, but it hasn't. Yeah, I mean, the comparison doesn't really like even out again for quite a while. It'll be relatively even once they start doing the Koga split, but even then, the it'll be slightly deceptive because the early, no, the late surges will have done Saffron and T, which is yeah. a few seconds, but you'll still have a good idea at that point. here because Wave's got harm, so he'll definitely be doing kick strats for Viridian Rival. I believe Chippy's going to be good to do that as well. Actually, I don't know how, again, Late Surge will exit, but I think it's your experience has caught up by that point, so...
His health is potentially really good. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if... Is Arbok even a range on Late Surge? Probably not. No, I don't think so. I think they just have to bite. But they won't die to anything. Oh, they might die to Poison Sting Poison. Mm. If they don't, that's what's good. Yeah. Good torrent for, for Giovanni and Surge. Torrent for Surge is very important. You're getting the, the rare hideout nugget. Has anything gone seriously wrong for any of these racers? Well, especially, so. there's been a few missed kicks, but there's not been terrible ones. Yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm oh. trying to think of like anything that's like gone wrong. But yeah, literally, missed kicks is like all I can really think of. None of them had an amazing bow rival. Is about the only thing. But again, that's that's, it's only turns lost. I think they all had to switch in. Now there's definitely no deaths. Everyone's holding the revive that they got from Moon. Yeah, overall, it's been a very clean race. Which is kind of boring from a current commentary standpoint. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone should just do early surge. Yeah. Should be required. For <laughs> entertainment value. Is the timer still inaccurate? I, oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, it started 10 seconds late. Roughly. That is a stonking etiquette raid, hello. Welcome to round two of the Fire Red Leaf Green Any% Percent tournament. This is a great race for you to have come raided into. This is probably the most highly contended race of the round. Um, we've got emulator record holder Kuka. I think he's still emulator record holder, unless Hananan has it. They're tied, uh, I think. Oh yeah, gross. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Wave Warrior is a world record contender for certain, and Chippy is... It probably seems a bit of a mean description in comparison, but he's definitely the dark horse of this tournament. He uh, has exploded out of the gate from round one, winning his ra round one race from pot three, I think it was. Something weird, and he's just a very, very solid racer. And this race has been excellent so far. Wave on nearly the exact no, literally the exact same health. So he's gonna he's gonna be in good HP for the next couple fights. So here comes the triple candy for Wave. Don't, I don't think he's going to have Torrent after the candies and the evolution. It'll be close. Yeah. It'll be close, but yeah, I think you're right. Chippy's got Glare too. Not ideal. Also, for anybody coming in, we do have slightly different routes here. Um, Kuka. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Kuka has done early surge, so despite being the furthest behind on screen, he's already fought an entire gym that the other two still need to do. So we are almost certain that Kuka has a fairly solid lead right now. Yeah. Way yeah, Kuka's on a... Chip. Yeah, go on, dude. Kuka's on a, a very good run. Like, yeah. Definitely best race time in the tournament so far. If it finishes. The rest they all are. We really can't. I don't think if you've got like the the pace that either Chippy or Wave has right now in any other race, you'd be complaining that much. It's just that these three are all excellent. Yep. So yep, just a good race is not going to do it. Stakes are much higher. That's for sure. Oh, Wave's got exact torrent. Ooh. And he got the confusion. 
Holy moly. Wow. That is a really good fight. Congrats. His health is good enough as well. It's maybe slightly low, but don't really want to heal out of 38, so... You don't level before Surge, right? So it's just for... No, he's just going to have 38. Yeah. Should be in a bit deeper torrent. With the potential to get damage from Kanga also. And yeah, Duke is caught up. He's on the same fight. It's nuts. <laughs> oh my god. It's a really good fight for Jiffy as well. Very nice. Here got fake out. Not complaining. Kind of yeah. He also gets confused. It. Okay. Technically, it's all three two hit Kangas guns there. Yeah. Air quotes. <laughs> we count those. So here's the movement that really loses the bulk of the time from Late Surge. Um, Cuckoo's gonna get Fly from the Fly Girl, and since he has Surge's badge already, he has access to Fly immediately. So he's just gonna be able to fly straight to um, Lavender Town, which is the next place he's gonna wanna go. Where um, the Late Surge runners are gonna have to bike all the way back through Saffron um, and back to Vermilion. Loses quite a bit of time. <laughs> There's a couple of small optimizations so that the routes won't technically equal out for a while yet, but it's only really picking up the T and speaking to the guards, so it's a matter of a handful of seconds. So Kuka's definitely got the lead right now. Yeah, I think by now it's at least two, three minutes over over wave. Uh, I don't think as much as much as two or three. I mean, it could be. Can oh, is pretty got, variable. You've got me there, yeah. <laughs> That's very true. Sorry, I watched this first try cans from Wave. Oh, I didn't lie! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How does he do it? <laughs> Nobody should ever doubt me again. <laughs> Oh my gosh. As, as first try as it possibly <laughs> could be as well. Well, that's a fair bit of time save. Okay, I'm going to retract two to three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely closer to two. He could try to throw the Moonstone and instead accidentally gives it. It is then, at that point, faster to just throw it on your bird. So now our Pidgey has a Windstone. Yeah. Cool. Nice little decoration. So yeah, Kuka now with a clear lead. Um, once Wave and Chippy are done with Surge, they're going to be going to Lavender Tower. not being too much of a friend to Chippy right now. Another little niche thing about Late Surge is that you can't open the TM case to pass the spinners mm. like you can for Early Surge. It's oh, a little bit right side. right side cans are gross. Yeah. Not even like Chippy's doing anything wrong here, he's just not getting the same luck that that wave got. So falling a bit further behind. It is 
mega kicking, technically for his life. You think he's gonna kick like the Kadabra? Yes, I think he will. If he's got the kicks. He's got two more, so he definitely can. Yep. He can growl if he's just correct time. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that, that makes sense. But yeah, he'll go for this. I think. And the crew. So it was worth it. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like the return on the torrent command. <laughs> what are you even doing putting that in number? I think if you put in uh, torrent one, it tells you that Shedinja can't have torrent. Which I also quite like. Sizzle's bot is uh, a blessing on PSR. <laughs> you must assume I'm a dumb bot. I got you, Wanley. Let me see what health. Uh, on oh, 19. That's a smidge low, but I'm fairly certain you can just Auron Berry that to good health. Yeah, yeah, I think Dependent on rat quick attacks. Jibby died? On what? What did Chippy die to? I missed it. He's just doing late surge, so I ignored his straight his feet. Wait, what? I don't understand. Unless he died to like lavender rival and has come back to this, what did he die to? Do we have any reporters on the ground that can tell us what happened? Oh, he could have water gun right you. Maybe that was what happened. I'm not even sure that he died though. Where is this coming from? He did uh, water gun right to you. Yeah, yep. Oh, damn. Yeah. Right, she's gonna have kill AI there, and Shockwave is still gonna hurt even if you're a Blastoise. That's rough. Actually, might have been quite a bit close to, to not killing. It was like he had 24, I think. Be surprised if it was a range. I'd love to know. Get in there. Wave with the lovely pause past there. Twenty-five to thirty. Oh, that was close. Okay. Ah, that does a lot. Well, I guess Blastoise's special defense must be a lot better. Yeah. I suppose she levels way higher as well. Anyway, Waves had a, a relatively clean mid game so far. Unfortunately, so was Kuka, so he's not really caught up anymore, but he's got a safe lead over Chippy now. Yeah. So Chippy and, Ku Chippy and Weaver are going to get a leg up on, on Koga, in theory, as a result of the uh, improved wheezing range, but... Um, Nobody ever hits that wheezing range, don't worry about <laughs> yeah. it. Yeah, <laughs> that never normally actually happens, but... Zero times it, two is still it zero. Should. It should, but it doesn't. Ooh. He missed 99% kick. But he's fine. That's dumb though. I 
in three minutes. No. Get out. I'm quite that unlucky. Attacks coming up here. Dodge is one. I'm fine if the Raticate does, because you can just potion instead of Auron Berry, which is. Yeah. Faster. Yeah. Yeah, this is fine too. He's in good shape. He does have. Oh no, he's mild. Yes, yeah, so he's gonna take more damage. He definitely wants to Auron Berry. Seemed like Chippy was a little bit unsure about that pass, so we played it safe. Always worth. Better to take two seconds and not potentially lose a minute and a half. You're right. Wave? Probably would like a quick attack, although if he gets it off the first rat, that's going to be scary. What is Kuka yeah. doing? Kuka? <laughs> what are you doing, friend? <laughs> thought he was on late surge for a second. <laughs> I think he was probably just looking at his notes or something and just holding left. Oh, that would, that would be funny. <laughs> <laughs> left button got stuck, oh no. Be toothy. It's turbo monster. If he's turboing a directional input, I don't really know what to say to him. That would just be like very fast consecutive left inputs. <laughs> Wouldn't even be like holding it down. Maybe, maybe if the turbo is good enough, you could. Oh my! Um, um, what in the hell? Did you not? That wasn't <laughs> safe! I hated everything about that! Wave took no quick attacks. Um, I don't really know how he's gonna deal with that health. 27's too low, 37's too high? He's got awful. Awful HP at the moment. I could be wrong though. The rich do get richer. Twenty-seven for thirty-nine should be fine. Okay. I will trust the genius of maths. Yeah, the fuck it, just your little guy just actually just doesn't have anything except just those words. So I mean, like, you kind of can just like extrapolate based off of those words. I mean, really good adaptation. You know how, like, Sapphire's Tin Lies a Guide is step one, X speed, uh, turn two, adapt. Kuka's, like, Fire Red Leaf Green Notes are step one, start the game, step two, adapt. <laughs> oh, that's a nice pass by wave there. Got pretty trolled by the, the spins, but played it played it well. Yeah. You cannot grab in the spare spare revive. I think it's fine. It's already got the the moon one still. Yeah, to be in like the same position that Wave was. He's actually pretty scared of quick attack, but. Yeah, he's fine if he dodges the first rat, but it becomes awful. No. Okay, he's healing for the fight. Okay. I don't know that I agree with this. I suppose 35 is just fine if he takes nothing. If he gets double, so, kind of, kind of. Well, I mean, if he gets double, if he gets double, he just potions and get. Oh well, yeah, right. no, because he's not—he's not, he's not going to take 20. He's going to take like 16, and then he is going to be out of torrent. But yeah, it's you kind of damned if you do, damned if you don't, because then you're just yeah. going to be cursing yourself if you take a quick attack off the first rat. Yeah. 
Hmm. Is Chippy gonna be in Torrent? At 42? Uh... He doesn't get 42 for COVID, does he? Yeah, he do. What? At Late Surge, yeah. Jesus. Where's he getting three? Are you sure he's gonna get three level ups? No, he's you can't eat twice when you get to 40. Oh. Gross. I didn't know they did that. Yeah, it makes the wheezing range 11 and 16 instead of 6 and 16. Yeah, almost certainly not then. Yeah, not not amazing. I'm glad you knew about that, because I ain't got a clue. Probably read the late surgeon house at some point. Alright, Cooker's stepping up to the plate. Will he save? I bet he doesn't save. I bet he doesn't either. <laughs> yeah. Shocker. <laughs> You know this Pokemon has acid armor. I think that's safe for chipping, but either way he's past it. That was a good roll for from the mod, oh, not that it matters. One. Oh he misses. Uh, get sludge. Oh, oh crit. Ooh, wow. Um this is interesting. I don't know how you do Oh, I think if he revives and then switches in rat on the bird death and then switch I don't know because he needs split experience. Mm. This could get ugly quick. But he's gonna X special, that's for sure. Um, yeah. so what end happens up... next might you be... see another minimize on the X special turn. Ooh. 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 I'm not okay. convinced that would have killed. That's good. It oh boy. Oh, he is dead. Jesus. He is dead, dead. That's it. Uh, that's. Nightmare the scenario. That sludge roll must have been amazing, by the way. 32, 32. yeah. Oh my god. Suddenly, gosh. Wave is in the lead. Uh. 32 is the 1 in 16. Well, 33 is the 1 in 16, but. Yeah. Yikes. Wow. I do think that was pretty unfair. He only saw one minimize and missed yeah, like no, four absolutely. moves after that. Absolutely, that was not very fair. I mean absolutely eternally punished for not saving, but Yeah, yeah. Wave also got an amazing role as well. Also oh, and he misses, misses too. Oh boy, okay, That's... he's going with the range for his life now. Is it 11 and 16, did you say? That's 11 and 16, bad. yeah. Much better than the alternative. But missing the range, having him heal on the on the slave is not ideal at all. Lemonade, Lemonade would be cool in this very specific scenario. <laughs> oh, he gets the crit. Take the crit, we take that. Yeah. Any day of the week. Yeah, with wave. that. Let's take the lead. One bad fight. And that is all it takes. Goku's got a special here. I don't know if. Yeah, he does know that. Toxic. Roll with it, maybe? Just so you can I at think, least hit this yeah, guy? Yeah. yeah and then you yeah, can yeah. just heal on the coughing, I think. I don't know if the coffee gets smokescreen. I think he maybe you just roll with it the whole uh, way. Maybe, but Weezing definitely... Yeah, maybe just the whole way works. So. Yeah, good shout. You're not really going to kill yourself out of it. So, And you could then... Work and also HP from down. this HP, also from this HP, it could Toxic again, the Weezing, if you gave it a turn. Yeah, maybe. Wow, yeah. okay. No, that's, that's actually pretty good now as well. So he, he can work his way down to Torrent for Blaine now. Oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of counting that's going to happen then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
But yeah, that, uh, that second fight worked out. <laughs> Only counting in the chat. Thank you very much. I love that they're all hitting the uh, spam limit gradually as well. <laughs> just, the messages are just stopping after a bit. Uh, Chippy going into Koga. Also on late third, so with the better losing range, potentially. Oh no, he hasn't candid. He's only four. I think he forgot. Or he, maybe oh, he oh, kept no. Torrent. He's yeah, done it to keep yeah, Torrent, yeah. hasn't he? Yeah. yeah, that's definitely what he did. That's clever. That's pretty smart. Uh, maybe you can use the candy somewhere else. Make you some better. I imagine you could just switch over to the standard route and double candy before Erica. Or the execute. Somewhere in there, anyway. Yeah. Anyway, you got he's the only one to get past Muck without any issues. I'd just bite here, to be honest. He does. He oh, flinches. He Wonderful. But he is going to lose Torrent for Blaine, which isn't amazing. No. He's got it. Oh, you don't level before Arcanine? Okay. Yeah, I don't think you will. Not off of two Pokemon. Or three, sorry. So then we're shot. If he didn't count at all, he just antidoted in the next bag. <laughs> Everybody counting in the chat, and Kuka's just like, I'll do it, whatever. This looks fine. 24 seems fine. Don't worry about it. And get caught. Good job. Yeah, I mean, the, the window you gotta get to is pretty wide, unlike before Brock. So it should be a little bit closer to to Kuker and um I mean he got a good Koga fight, so in theory he should be a little bit closer to Wave too. But um We're certainly not looking at leads here that can't be uh, decimated by bad elite falls. Yeah, so exactly. Nobody's out of it by any means at the moment. And I'm fairly certain whoever's well, I mean Chippy's on pace for being third here, but I think Chippy's pace is potentially good enough to bop Zan, who is currently the best right, top three right. finisher. I think it yeah. was a two twelve. So, yeah, Chippy's pace isn't even particularly bad. Just no. other racers have a little bit better. I mean, realistically, the only mistake anybody's made so far is Chippy clicking Water Gun on Raichu. And you could make an argument for Kuka not saving before Koga, but he yeah. did kind of get screwed. I wonder if you can get like an extra level for like Sabrina or something. Maybe out speeding it becomes easier. Oh yeah, they're doing they're they're both having to car boss, aren't they? I don't know if Chippy got it. Maybe it's his I mean it is it is a lot to do on the fly if you're really thinking about that, but I guess. Um I hope it theoretically it doesn't if he didn't. He's also teaching Blizzard here. I guess it doesn't matter where you teach it. It's just I've not seen anybody do that before. I think Shira does that in record. Oh. Believe it or not. Uh, I mean, realistically, it's in a completely separate menu you just tap right to, so I guess anywhere yep. is fine. Yeah, it really doesn't matter all that much. It just threw me off because I've never seen it before. I was like, that doesn't match my muscle memory. Yeah, I'm the same way. Standard for late surge. 
Oh, okay, you don't menu in Erica's gym. Makes sense. Yeah, but he will need to menu in Erica's gym because he's not doing late surge late game anymore because he didn't candy before Goga. But yes, I guess that makes sense for why he did it. But he needs to candy somewhere. Unless he's about to do it after Blaine. Could just candy in the fire menu. Thank you, Alan. That answers my question. Kuka talked to Blaine twice. I saw that. Actually, if I'll you think about it, the one the menu in the early surge route is is an extra menu, right? Because you're not menuing for any other reason after eggs. Um, I guess, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was just trying to think it through, but yeah, I think you're right. Thanks for not saying yes to Bill. Very important. Did you know that if you say yes to Bill, you can lose 15 minutes on your any percent speedrun? Yeah, not very fast. Follow me for more life hacks. Does the extra experience from the Koga Reef I do anything for Kuka? No, I don't believe so. Uh, well... I did see he hit 42 um, after Blaine, so he could have candied in the fly menu. I don't know if he did. He oh, didn't. that is true, yeah. I mean, he's definitely about to do nothing because he's about to normalize his age, his experience anyway. But yes, he could yeah. have uh, could have candied now. But yeah, I don't think the extra experience would make any difference. Um, you probably just throw your level ups off in Elite Four, which might help, but might be a hindrance. I'm not sure what people do these days on Erica, but I feel like Wave's probably gonna go for the Blizzard. Yeah, okay. I'm a little surprised um, Wave didn't go for X special there. Because he's got the health to tank Tangela. And he's getting punished for it. Also got the HP of tank Giga Drain, but I guess, I mean, yeah. He is he's hitting now... for his life. Yeah. It's just so likely that you just get ingrained from Tangela and it's all fine as well. He has oh, missed. No. Oh boy. And we're back in the game. <laughs> I don't know if he picked up the second revive. Andrew, where did he use the first one? He did. Okay. He's certainly not, not lost the lead, but... Yeah, I understand. I saw that he's got a, a dead bird, but I actually can't think where. Oh, it will have been Boat Rival. Because he hasn't centered or full healed anywhere since there. They do mm. it right before on early on late surge. So that was just his moon revive. But yeah, that's Three. not not a horrific death in that sense. Like his health's fine now. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't have to heal. Yep. Mm. So not Horrible. But if Puka hits this blizzard, it's a s significant jump up for him again. Also, again, could have specialed on the tangle. Oh, he's missed! Nope. They've also missed. Okay. okay. Well, that's better. Okay, here's the minor time save for wave he can fly to saffron here whereas kuka's gonna have to fly to celadon and give the tea to the guard wave's gonna do the pulse pass on the scientist i love this pass thank you thunder 147 question mark <laughs> that does look like a thunder optimization i'd believe it Wave potioning there. I actually think 69 would have been fine. 
you need around 80, but if you're not going to be X-speeding on Sabrina, which he won't be doing because he picked up the car boss, he might find that he's not in deep enough torrent to hold it through the entire Giovanni split. Unless he gets a crit or something. So yeah, Chippy's not in torrent, so he just blizzarded the Victory Bell, and he's going to be blizzarding the Vile Flume as well. Um... Yeah, not great, but... I think he misses missed. as well. Wow. wow. Okay. Jesus. We are Zero for threes. Three for seven blizzards in Erica. <laughs> Yeah, all, every man. one of them could have all done the spec strats and none of them did. <laughs> like... <laughs> oh yeah, this is kind... I think his health's going to work out. I don't think that's too high for wave, but it's close. 15 would have been just nicer. I'm, I'm he... happy for people to disagree with me in chat. But... I still am not sure whether he's X speeding or not. For uh, wave picked up Carbos. I'm almost because of Carbos. Okay, so I think so, yeah. I saw him use it, so he won't. So then need... it may be a concern. Then yeah. yeah, he's close. I mean, he'll hold it for ten HP more. Forty-eight. Uh, he'll hold it for eleven, so he might be fine. And I'm saying it's fine for 49 in chat. 51 out of 153 seems like exact horror. Wave is forcing guards back Bruno, yes. We believe Chippy is as well. They both didn't fight Joff. Yeah, Chippy's carbosing right now, so yes, they both are doing. Which is now. strange because they both, I don't think they had Torrent, but they both had like high enough health to just kind of do Josh. But I guess not going in in Torrent is slow, especially if you don't get the damage. Yeah, Wave Pass self rival with no real issues. Kuka's health is pretty lovely as well. Yeah. Yeah. Chippy does not save. Ooh, I hope you hit your blizzards, my friend. Mind you, he did say he was going to buy, like, 9x accuracy, so maybe he's just going to double act. I mean, it would be pretty devastating if he if he died here, regardless. Yeah. He just literally have 8 accuracies on him, so you might just be doubling. Yeah, actually, yeah, that's true. I don't hate this. It may just be maybe... faster. It's maybe a bit safe when you're potentially looking at third in this race, but at the pace he's on, he could be looking at like the best pot three time. He did easily. say he was going to be playing very safe this race. He did, yeah. But um, I don't know if he's going to be playing for you know other people's paces. Pretty important if you want to stay for the next round. <laughs> Cooker biting the keybone, of course. <laughs> hey, is it health to tank it? I think that's fine. Chippy might want to stall a turn here. Oh, he's not. Mm, 39 out of 138. Very similar to Waves. This was higher than Waves. So he that's may cool. be in trouble. Yeah, he is actually. He's a, he's a good chunk higher. Because Waves is just coming in under. Over or under 0.5 Kangaskhan range misses? Under. Gotta be under. That range is so likely. It feels way more likely than it is. Yeah. It's weird how, like, it's the same range. Is it the same range as the Voltorb in Mount Moon? But they feel wildly uh, different. No, the Voltorb, I think, is the same as the Onyx, maybe. Maybe, yeah. I mean, the, basically, the Voltorb in Mount Moon is non existent. No one hits that range. Yeah, yeah.
Yeah, 9 and 16, yeah. Ah, okay. It's looking good for the under. <laughs> Wave didn't get Carbos then. I just watched him X speed on Kadabra. Oh, does he think he's gonna level out? I, but he X speeded. He X speeded. And also, on, you're supposed to Why? do it on Venonat. <laughs> but I thought he got Carbos. Maybe he just didn't and I made it up. Maybe no, he definitely like, did, right? I saw Chippy use it and I saw. I saw I Chippy. See. I did not. I, I will say I didn't see Wave use it. Yeah, I thought I. He's, he's gonna take Future Sight. Oh, that's fine, I guess. Weird. Um... Yeah, I don't know what's happening, <laughs> I'll be honest. I mean, he's gonna be fine now. He's worked around it. And he's not gonna be forced into guard spec Bruno. If but that yeah, was I'm, the case, yeah. Yeah, I'm almost certain you're just supposed to speed on Venered Moth, though. You are, yeah. So I think he must have done it, just... I don't know. Yeah. I couldn't tell you. <laughs> we'll have to ask him afterwards. Uko will have got the car boss. Uh, 30 is perfect. You can car boss and guarantee everything, but also not be forced into Bruno guard spec. So he's just going to mash surf for the next 10 minutes. Or water balls. Wave skip the Carbos. Interesting. Well, yeah, I mean, he must have. If he was pressing the X speed and Sabrina, yeah, yeah, could yeah. Just, yeah. Uh, but he could do spec threats. That's cool. Yeah. I mean, that definitely started with me, Vane. I won't lie. I. <laughs> Definitely when oh yeah, I saw Wave pick up the card loss with all the confidence of a man that does not know what he's talking about. I must have just mixed it up with Chippy. But the the key fight for the car boss is gone now. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. It's really only Chippy that's potentially gonna struggle with Bruno. Mm-hmm. So yeah, Chippy just has to manage his surf count a little bit. He's preparing to pop out a torrent, not be able to water pulse some things in Giovanni. Uker in chat saying, I'm gonna run out of full restore. He's, what? <laughs> Did he use one somewhere? I mean, he just sent us. If he's used his full restore already, he just sent us after Giovanni in this fine. Just a smidge of time loss, but. Mm -hmm. Just triple, triple super, super push. push. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. That's also an option, I guess. Mm -hmm. But you really want your super potions. Oh, money because of death? I mean, you normally buy 14 and he died once, so I would imagine he's still going to be able to afford like 10. If you have yeah, to that use... sounds right. If you have to use 10 full restores in Elite 4, you've got other issues than running out of them. <laughs> he lost 1400, yeah, he's gonna he's gonna get like 10 or 12. Oh, and I mean, he's got the nugget if he needs that, too. Yeah. I don't think he does. But he won't. <laughs> Yeah, you've gotten a lot of money since since the blackout. Even if you lost like half of the money you had, yeah, you, you've fought so much since then that you haven't lost anything from. Oh, 
I'm fairly certain it's 14 that you normally get if you've got normal money. Yes, E4 will almost certainly decide this. The The difference between Wave and Kuka is significant, but mm, like one death is going to be enough to swap it around, I think. Yeah, We're I think it's... four pokes apart. Yeah, I think it's around... correct. Chippy's going to need to pray for a couple of deaths, I think. Yeah, a little bit more than another death on top of that. Or just like... You know, better, better fights. Also, I don't. I think he really will require a death. I can't. Well, see no, him. no, yeah, like a, a death and or an, an endless Agatha troll could be good. Yeah, he actually still has Torrent right now, so, I mean, literally, like, the bulk of the, the PP issues are just, like, non-existent, really. Okay, yeah. Wave heading into Viridian Rival, he's gonna save. Probably means he's not gonna double XAC. Actually, it almost certainly means that. Kuka just had a stroke in chat. <laughs> Bruno is unplayable with this Missy. Do I need to break out the braille to figure out what you're saying? <laughs> <laughs> Messy. <laughs> We're going to get some 93% uh, blizzards. Kuka just making sure he's still got the right idea. Oh, and the leader wow, swap. Okay. <laughs> you very, did that. As stupid as this sounds, that was a very good reset by Wave. Like not sitting there and contemplating your existence for a little bit before realizing you've just got a reset. As soon as that blizzard missed, he's dead. AB starts Let's Play again. Good presence of mind. But yeah, it's very, very close between these two now. That's not a, a, a usually costly death, but it is a good, ma good amount. It is pretty tight now. It's like, what, 15, 20 seconds at most? Yeah. Between the two of them. Chippy sat there justified in his choice to buy like nine X Ax. <laughs> Chippy's just gonna be sailing right in. Yeah. It's interesting to be fair, with the fact that he's skipping two like fairly mandatory saves by doing this is uh it's notable. It yeah. might be a good strat. Yeah, I think one they was bringing up this to me earlier. It did seem like pretty Pretty cool and not all that slow, honestly. Yeah, because an extra turn of setup is definitely way better than a save. Like, but then there is the extra time to be able to afford this many exacts. They aren't cheap. All three races on the same fight. Pidgeot's just very safe to set up on, so you might as well just... Yeah. Really, I really don't hate Double XX at all. It's like, really... The more I'm thinking about it, the more I quite like it. I'm already grabbing an extra XX for Lance, personally, because that fight's awful. Yeah. That one is just, like, pretty non-negotiable. For Well, I mean, if you need to save time, but, like, otherwise... Yeah. 
Well, it's just it just forces a save, like. And then realistically, if you're wanting to play a little bit risky and you've got the extra X accuracy, you can just save for Agatha and that's it. <laughs> it's yeah, pretty justified. Like, I mean, literally all you have to do besides double X sack for Lance is just make sure you have a Squirtle that you don't die to Hyper, hyper Beam crit from full. Yep. Like, it's the only death con if you just heal correctly. Mild loses again. But yeah, this is very close between Kukra and Wave. I'm really Chippy's at most a minute behind. Like this is yeah not an insurmountable. No, it is. Like it's... it's way better as well that Wave's dropped back because now like one death for either of them pulls Chippy into it. He like isn't. He isn't kind of relying on multiple deaths from people here. He he can get away with like pulling this back off of one late death for one of them. Not that you'd ever want to sit there and wish other people like right. die in the run, but at the end of the day he's here to win. Yep. Is how it is sometimes. Mm -hmm. So nobody has sand true, so everybody's gonna be teaching strength in this menu. Um so no time loss or gain there. Yeah, the routes are as lined up as they can be now, barring stat differences. But truly with a big raid as well. Good timing. We've got a close finish ahead of us. So apparently yeah. Kuka and Wave are seven seconds apart, and Chippy is a minute behind Wave. So this is... this is a good one. We knew it would be. We knew this would be a good race. That's an awful place for the rappel to wear out. It scared the hell out of me. Oh, congrats on the PB. Wait, really? That was fast. Oh my gosh. Must have been the first run he did while, while streaming. Oh. Oh, why well, you've missed the boulder? I saw that. They're pushing the same boulder. Yeah, not a lot to talk about right now. These runners are all decently good with their execution, so we're not going to be expecting any optionals. Mm -hmm. And we really are just uh, in a Lorelei waiting room. Yeah, Hailless can make a big difference for any of these runners right now. I never want to wish... I'm not wishing bad on anybody here, but I would love to see only Chippy get Hailless. <laughs> just for the I mean, interest of the race. That'd be perfect, yeah. Yeah. Just to keep them on the toes. So yeah, Kuda's going to be the first one in. He's bagging 32 Ultra Balls. Uh... Sunrise is 13, yeah. It's very much <laughs> plenty. Yeah, that's like one less than normal. <laughs> it's totally fine. Uh, yeah. Again, hopefully, um, hopefully Chippy's gonna be able to react to to the other racers and what happens here. Um, if he has a chance to to catch up, hopefully he can take it. In a shocking turn of events, I don't think Kuka saved. Yeah. Which I think, if you've got enough X specials, is fine. Two I agree. So that's a pretty good start. It's, it, it's pretty rare to actually die to Lorelei, if you yeah. heal it correctly. Oh, 
Yeah, I'll turn four. four. Mm. Little icky. Maybe it gets turn, turn two. two. Okay, so the plan's coming together, we just need Chippy to go hail us. <laughs> Pretty normal dugong for Kuka there. I think Wave's gonna be uh as long as he can avoid like a freeze here or anything, he should be fine as well. No protect for Kuka. A nice flint for Wave. Wave's got pretty comfy well, they're on pretty similar HP. They both have pretty comfy HP. Well, not uh, really. Hooker's in range for a crit. Yeah. I don't yeah. think he will heal. <laughs> so. Hmm. But we have got an earlier hail, so I think he will be out of range for a crit given his defense. Yes. Which is nice. He should be fine. Oh, Chippy's going for the two X Oh, oh, he, he gets crits. the crit. Okay, get the flinch as well. Oh, oh my okay. goodness, he's got hailless. No, he's not yet. He's got a spec yeah, he does. again. He can't get hail from this HP. That's oh, can he not? Strat. Oh, yeah. of course, yeah, yeah. Wow, genius. <laughs> I mean, the flinch is great, but damn. Okay, all according to the script. Let's go. That helps pretty good for Chippy as well. Uh, Wave got crit flinched bite. That's really good. So Wave and Kuka are very, very close. In fact, they're basically tied because Kuka's got a heal paralysis, whereas Wave doesn't. Chippy, Chippy does have to force time. guard spec here, so hopefully he'll come out of this, H this, of this fight with good enough HP to do that. Which yeah. I think if he keeps this HP yeah. somehow, which would He's be perfect. He'd love to see Bite flinch into Bite crit. They're both saving for Bruno. I don't disagree with that. Oh, this is so close between these two. And like, Chippy is not out of this at all. What a good race. Uh, Kuka did not heal Paralysis. He's gonna four star turn one. On 94? Interesting. He flinches! Get the crit, or the flinch again. Oh. Uh, okay, I mean, the super potion. work here. Okay, potion work, double potion works better, double yeah. Double potion works, yeah, for certain. Um, yeah, his defense is really high. Single yeah, potion might even too high. Uh, He's still fine. I mean, I've got to be honest, when it comes to races, I'm more of a fan of uh, just healing to 80 if I can do it before Bruno rather than going in and doing full restore. He's only got one potion. No. Okay, that's really bad now. <laughs> he needs good rolls from the Onyx. Okay, he's supering. Maybe, maybe favorite Earthquake over Rock Team. <laughs> Copium. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, please, just two Earthquakes and he's totally fine. I mean, he, does he have another guard spec to use? Maybe? No, I don't think he does. Well, uh, maybe. It depends on what you... He definitely bought extra because of the axe. We'll see. He has five, yeah. Okay, okay so... he's got a few, yeah. <laughs> Earthquake's got one. Earthquake. All right. Okay. In, ooh. Um, no, ooh. don't. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Imagine getting too much damage from this setup. Yeah. <laughs> so Wave, purely by being able to do really good strats for Bruno, now has the lead. Pretty convincing. 32 That's is good. fine. Yeah. 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 With 31 rash, yeah. So Wave has a lead. It's not much, but he does have the lead on Kuka. Um, Agatha may decide a bit here. Kuka is saving for Agatha, which doesn't make sense because it's like a pretty reasonable fight to actually die to. Yeah, this, I think this save is mandatory. Yeah. Unless you are desperate to overtake somebody. Has this been the only save in the run for Kuka? No, he saved before Bruno, of all trainers. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, since that, then I think the last save was. Um, Brock. Cans. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Cans, yeah. 
Uh, all right. Wait, Shadow punch for Cougar. Oh my that's God. that's kind of fine. At this it's mild. It's not great. Oh no! Yeah. Mm. He's gonna have to double super. I think. Twenty nine. You just can't risk that. No. And this might not even be torrent. No, this will be fine. Ooh. Okay. Nice low roll. <laughs> uh, well, he's gonna hold that. It'll be fine for the rest of the fight. Yeah. He does have pretty yeah, good gets. HP balance. So yeah, that's a that's a chunky lead for Wave now though. It's nothing a Lance death can't fix, but it's kind of hard to die to Lance if you're playing yep. it right. Yep. And it's not enough time loss to really help Chippy that much. Right. Although it does potentially put Kuka in range to that a Lance death puts Chippy ahead. Or maybe it does. Oh Pretty my old. goodness. He's got really good defense though. This should just be one super and he's good. I yeah, think. hopefully he gets low rolled Peaceful. here. A nice 25, please. Uh, oh. I'd go for it. I'd go for it. Okay, he's going. Okay. okay. Yeah, cool. Just hit now. I think that was the correct play because... Uh, Okay. You could, All right. Yeah. You could have got prediction roll, shadow punch kills, and then low rolled, which then the surf's guaranteed, and he's just good to go. But yeah, uh, waves going into Lance as Kuka comes out of Agatha. This is very close. Will Kuka save for Lance with a mid defense mild? Mm. I, if he doesn't, I, mean, I think, he's a, I think like... this is a bit egregious if he doesn't, I'll be honest. I think he needs to save this. Because you you could just get hyper being crit and lose the entire race and probably fall behind Zan, so yeah. Because there is a cutoff for a pot three time that they have to beat to advance. Mm-hmm. Uh, interesting waves going for the not going for the double bite. With 31. Yeah. It's, could be some time safe for Cooper. Cooker probably will do that, yeah. Yeah. It is a range, but I do really like the strat because you get to rip two bite flinches off, potentially. He doesn't heal here. Uh, I think that's fine. He can just heal. He double X, he double X act, so he can just heal on... He did not double X act. Did he, he not? Dead. He did not double X act. Oh, oh my okay. god. Okay, heal here, heal here, heal here. Yeah, heal, yeah, and yeah, yeah, then... Yeah. yeah, you can X-Act here as well, he's got to. Uh, well, no, he risks uh, paralysis, I guess. This is weird. Kuku is not having a particularly great Gyarados, either. Although that flinch definitely helps. I don't know if Chippy saved. But I think it's kind of fine if he didn't. Wave just trying to do his part to maintain the uh, the content of the race. Definitely respect it. Oh, he had to elixir as well because of the miss. Yeah. I, nope. yeah. Not mm. great. <sighs> Definitely give some cougar a, a window here. Did he go for um double bite blizzard? Yes, I believe he me? did. But he had to heal after like turn two. I think he got double dragon range and was already mm. in. Uh, Hyper Beam range after that. Chippy with not a great Gyarados either. It's when he waves Gyarados was probably the best one, but then it screwed him for the rest of the fight. It's when he missed the Blizzard. This is still close between the top two. And Chippy's definitely in it a bit more now. I, I would have suspected that Chippy did double XX, so he should be fine. Well, he may not have done to try and catch up. But yeah. Well, he's got to heal anyways, right? So I think if he was going to heal... It's also not healing. Because he's dead to Aerodactyl if it uses Hyper Beam. Does Kuka skip the save for Champ? This would basically tie them if he does. Ah, well, no, not quite, but... I think he may. I think I would in this position. You might just want to take the save he's second saving, place. Okay. I suppose if you die, then you absolutely throw away. What is a fairly comfy second place here? 
But Chippy's in a pretty good spot to, even if he doesn't get second place, he's in a pretty comfy spot to get the best pot three time. Yes. At least for right now. Because this is a pretty good time still for him, if nothing bad happens from here. Mm -hmm. He is healing. He gets crit. He's fine. That's fine, but... it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. okay. <laughs> it's just kind of annoying because he's got to watch that bar go all the way back up again for the full restore afterwards. Uh, I think... Oh, Goku's got... Orange. He's still setting up the... Th Don't get crit now. Okay. I think he's plus three and torrent. Which could potentially be enough to overtake Wave. No, it doesn't look like it. Oh. Uh, um, I mean, he's going to get a free wait, turn what? here. I'm confused. He's always going to get either Solar Beam or Growth here, so I guess that's... Fine. Yeah, but you're Blizzard in... What did he what? just do? I don't understand that. And Chippy's in second now. I'm I so confused. I don't understand what happened. <laughs> did he exact? I, I don't know. Uh, no, he definitely didn't exact. Um, but he was at plus three and torrent, so he could have just done bite yeah, surf. Yeah, bite surf, and that's just safe. Well, yeah, I thought, I'm sure, well, I, I didn't but... count, I did not count how many specials he did, but I can't imagine he was that low health and didn't have enough to triple expect. I mean, if he was going to skip x then he probably should have just gone for Blizzard turn one on Venusaur. Yeah, that's just strange. Wave's having a very comfortable fight now. It's very close between Chippy and Kuka, though. Uh, Chippy's plus three, no torrent. GG to Wave. Wave has won with what looks like a 207. Pretty good time. Yeah. I think that's going to be second best time this round so far. We, uh, Macwin got a 206, so... So yeah, this is it's going to be f close for this uh, second place though. Chippy's definitely got the lead, but things can go wrong. Cougar is bite surfing this time. Okay. He's definitely plus three. Maybe he wasn't a plus three last time then. I just don't know what situation you ever full restore on Venusaur. Mm. And then pick Manju as yeah. I suppose you'd have to pick Blizzard. You don't want to bite surf after the full restore. Yeah, so as long as Chippy doesn't get an untimely crit here, he's going to be good. Thrash crit may kill here, though he has like the best defense possible. He's just going to play it completely safe. Okay. Uh, this is My... so close for, for second place. Yeah, well, I think Chippy probably has it. He probably has it now, yeah. Hello, Wave Warrior. Hi. Nice flinch. That is... Yeah, that's no, why I have to do it. Yeah. That's two, yeah. two for two on getting a crit flinch in races, by the way. <laughs> Never in a run, in a PB attempt, though. Because, of course. <laughs> how did yeah. how did Cooker die on champ? We, we don't, don't know. exactly know. He <laughs> ended up full restoring turn one on the Venusaur, and we don't entirely understand why that was a thing. Because I, I thought he was at plus three torrent, so should have just bite surfed. So maybe he just forgot that that, that was a strat? If he's yellowing to try to win the race, it saves a turn if it works. But it's kind of silly thing to do, but if it fails, you get third. But yes. shouldn't you just be shouldn't you just be blizzarding Venusaur turn one in that case? And then healing on Gyarados uh, if you really need to? Yes. That's the safer version. That that's what I'm saying. I don't know why you'd ever do it yeah, on Venusaur. You're exactly right, so I don't know. Well, we can ask him very shortly. He will be here very <laughs> yep. soon. Don't worry. I mean, to be fair to Kuka, he's going to get the best pot three times so far. And it's going to be basically a 210 flat. He might still advance on that. Yeah. There's only two races left for that to get beaten. 
uh, note for whoever's organizers of this, I accidentally started like half a second to a second early, so it's add a second to my time. Uh, oh, I should probably check what the race time time is for this, actually. Uh, yeah, so... Two oh seven thirty nine for Wave. We were, we, were, we were off on the timer at the beginning. So. I was off on the timer. <laughs> Head Bob just I was to take why I was, blame for that. I was wondering, because I was comparing you know, how far behind I was Kuka in the early game, and it looked like it was way farther behind than it should have been. So Kuka has to take a 25 second penalty at the start because of Emulator. No, 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 I mean... The timer uh, in general. Yeah. I felt like I should have been like 30 seconds behind, but I was saying 50 seconds behind or whatever. Congrats on a surprise second place chippy. Yeah, congrats. I, Congratulations. I I don't even understand. I I whenever I lost the surge and I lost again because I just kept smashing A, I immediately turned off the stream. I had no idea what happened. I guaranteed I thought I got third. You were I was just like, you were in third up until Kuka lost uh, Yeah, literally he just champ. died a champ. He died, just now. died on champ. He died a champ. Yeah. And yeah. we, we oh, don't dude. exactly know how. No, we're about to ask him. Here he is, the man of the moment. <laughs> Kuka, what happened on that first champion fight? We need to know. Uh, so I was only in plus two, and I accidentally full restored instead of exact kind of thing. So oh, okay. Oh. You okay. so were only plus two. Yeah. Damn. Oh, that was, yeah. well, you, you took a lot of damage then. I'm a mile 21, of course. Well, yeah, but even then. <laughs> I got AA on every turn. Uh, two was for a... two on getting crit flinch on Lapras and getting heal as champ in races. Dude, when Chippy got the the Poke guy early hailless thing, we popped off because the race just became way closer after that. Yeah, that no, was actually that was, insane. That, was that Dugon race. crit, oh yeah. Man. And then I got a, a perfect uh, Bruno to follow it up. I got Earthquake, which screwed me over, and then the Rock Tomb Mist bailed me out. Chippy also went in with way too, well not way too high, but fairly high HP because he couldn't double potion and then got Earthquake the first two turns and had to heal, which is the stupidest <laughs> thing I've ever seen as well. Yeah, yeah for, guard spec shocks just do not work, but it, luckily it worked out, I guess, somewhat this time, so... Yeah, yeah you two oh. had very different approaches to the same situation for, uh, with 31 speed and not having enough speed EVs. Yeah, actually, Wave, what was with speeding on Kadabra? Uh, forcing 31, or forcing guard spec stats on Bruno is extremely bad if you don't get good HP for it. Well, why didn't fair, you do it why, on Venusaur? Why on though? <laughs> Sorry, what was your question? But why, why did you do speed on the Kadabra and not the Venomoth? Uh, because I had no person berry and Kadabra couldn't kill me. Oh, ah, that's interesting. I've never seen anybody do that Fascinating. before. Fascinating. It's just slower, but it's safer on Kadabra. Interesting. Um, and anyway, I made two misplays in that race, I think. I accidentally spec'd on a tower rival, but I think I recovered that all right. And then, uh, I should have healed on Gyarados on Lance. But, again, I think I recovered all right. I got lucky that I didn't die. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was pretty scary. Uh, but, I mean, I think all around, like, pretty well played race from, like, all three of you. I mean, all, all of you yeah. getting sub 210, well, I guess not. Like, <laughs> pretty <laughs> close, like, <laughs> close enough. Damn it. 210, 04. Um, yeah. Like, very know, impressive. Like, my time is different on the stream, I don't know. Yeah, I started the timer 10 seconds late, don't worry about it, it goes by race time. <laughs> but, uh, I yeah. mean, at the moment, all three of you are currently set to advance. Because that well, is the best pop advancing. three time. Yeah. Well, that is the best pop three time by about two minutes at the moment. That's a pretty tough time to beat for a third place time, honestly. I have to agree, yeah. I, I, I don't really I've doubt it. How many races are left this round? Two. One of them is currently More. happening, and then there's one happening tomorrow. So yeah, I would very much expect Kuka to advance on this. It does unfortunately mean we confirm Zan has been knocked out of the tournament. Uh, Unfortunate. Very sorry for him. You know how upset I was when I died a Surge, man. We didn't yeah, even I see cannot it. believe I, won't lie. I just spin. I was like I was like, oh I'm planning ahead, planning ahead, and then I turned over, watched the stream for like a second, and then I realized I hit water gun. I immediately <laughs> turned the stream off. I'm like, I'm not getting distracted again. And then of course I I a potion instead of orange berry, so I can't uh double rare candy on Koga. So I I risked that. I just oh, yeah, risked Cooper, everything. Why did you forward. save for Koga? <laughs> Why did I what? Not save for Koga. 
How to revive? I don't know. <laughs> Wait, did you have a bad Koga? Oh. Uh, he died. Was, yeah. He I fully died. died. He, he I was fully wiped. Both Mog and Weezing, oh. and I had a revive. And then I got crit by Mog after missing, and then he, he did miss it. A range. He got yeah. one minimize and missed like four surfs as well, which is yeah. pretty wow. crap. So I don't know. I don't think it's totally on me, but I guess. Oh, it definitely was not. <laughs> no, that, that sounds absolutely was not. What the hell? I just took the black out. I don't know. I don't. I don't think I would maybe have saved like thirty, maybe forty-five seconds if I'd saved, but I would also have lost the save time, right? Yeah. I don't know. No, Dude, Kruger, your really search hard. was insane. Yeah, that was. Yeah, it was dope. certainly a fight. <laughs> well, I, I was. T I looked over. I'm like, there's no shot. This man just got confused into kick hit. I'm like, oh, I was like, Shockwave turn one. I was like, holy. Yeah, that would have been double swap, probably, because I didn't really want an Oran super because I'm mild, and I kind of wanted my Oran for Koga. The, per the best double. search I've ever gotten was when I was relearning this game and practicing Rock Tunnel, so I had to go from a save at Cans, and my search fight, I got turn one Shockwave and then Water Pulse Confuse. Free fight. That's, that's what happened. He, that's, that's exactly what happened. what happened to Kuka. He got Shockwave turn one, Water Pulse Confuse, and then hit the Wait, kick. Wait, but then why, why are you talking about kick? Because he, he hit the kick. He wasn't in Torrent. What? Okay, fine. I was in torn. <laughs> but yeah, that's that's a crazy fight. Also, congrats to Wave that I manifested you first try cans. Yeah, no, I got perfect cans. That's fun. <laughs> no, I literally went. That's alright. Wave's just gonna get first try cans. Oh, there it is. <laughs> uh, I died to Erica. I missed two blizzards. That's fun. Literally, all you... three of you missed blizzards. Yeah, there was yeah. you between the three of you. You hit three out of seven blizzards <laughs> on Erica, and all three of you could have expect on Tangler as well. I couldn't. I had no. Surf. I couldn't. Okay. Yeah, well, well, I, mean, I guess wow. I could, but if I got ingrain, isn't it just really bad because I'm not in torrent? No, no. ingrain's totally fine. Well, you just bite yes, stuff. you need you do need to be in torrent. Yes. Oh yeah, you need torrent. Yeah. You had yeah, torrent, torrent though, didn't you? No, I was I was high no, because I had a double candy after. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. So he double blizzarded. Yeah, you're right. And you're yes, right. I absolutely would have uh, specced on Tangela, but because I missed a surf on Koga, I had no surfs. <laughs> That's why your water pulls the pony to smile. Not <laughs> uh... <laughs> <laughs> in my notes. You can water pulse both Growlithe and Pony to. Oh, yeah, obviously you can. Safety I for just, surfs. I wasn't, you know, always well, just of piloting. Yeah, it's not a no biggie anyway. We are absolutely uh, nitpicking all three of you getting nearly sub 210. <laughs> Not say nothing about water pulse, which is why I didn't think of it. All right. All right. I also got toxic on my on my muck when I after had blacked out, which was pretty nice because then I could just let it run to torn. We were sat there like, where is he going to heal the, the poison in the fight? And <laughs> got to the end, it's like, oh, he could just get poisoned for. You know, he can just drop his HP now for Blaine, and it's fine. That's fun. There was a lot of counting in chat. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone just counted and Kuku was just like, I'm just going to add to the next menu. Oh look, my health is fine. <laughs> I was like, I think I was like, when I entered, I was like at 40 and I was like, I don't really care, I just heal with the menu. Because like, mid-20s is fine. Yeah. Alright, any, any last words? Or we will move everybody over to the other channel to watch the other race that's actively happening. I had a pretty good start until Koka. I hate that bird crit on Spiro. Oh yeah. And then oh, yeah, into yeah. Three, there's three additional encounters afterwards and then didn't get another bird until after that. Oh, did? Wait, did you, did you get like three Nidos or something? I got, I think I got a Mankey, two Nidos, and then I got the Pidgey. Yeah, I, I remember looking over for you, looking for something. I just so I, I told Way Warrior to go for Rock to miss and then he tackled after he healed and I thought it was pretty funny. Yeah, one of you got like the oh, yeah. max roll prediction roll and then got tackled. Yeah, he, he, I got tackle on Onyx. I was like, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> on this <laughs> run, uh, in the rings, that's when you. Yeah, Chippy. The max roll. Yeah, Chippy crit the Spiro, two Nidos, a Mankey, and then finally got his fly. Oh, yeah, I needed to take uh, two damage on Colton to get perfect torrent, and I got three string shots. <laughs> I got the. God bless Colton. I, I got it immediately tackled. And uh, it was good torrent. Oh. Yeah, the best torrent leaving leaving uh, Brock, and then just had nothing after Colton. 
yeah, you went through the the second book catcher with no torrent, which is just mm. the worst. Yeah, that's awful. But yeah, honestly, yeah. like I think considering you guys got fairly average luck ultimately, the uh, two at what two oh seven, two oh nine, two ten is very very good. I'm very happy I got to commentate this race. Yeah, I got good work, everybody. Elo. <laughs> good work Fairies. as well, Headbob. Thank you. And thank you to Jordan as well for fixing the streams in the background. Thank you for your commentary, which was probably good, I don't know. Yeah. It was okay. Yeah. It was alright. We'll be fine. Um, yeah, thank you everybody for watching. We are quite shortly going to raid you into the other PSR TV channel so you can watch the other content race that's happening, Main Kadir, Randall. They're about 45 minutes into that. Thank you to the racers, and see you next time. <laughs>